Friday morning. You're about to dump my paper towel holder over. Yes! Oh. 1.3! I just hit the crud out of my toe. And let me tell you, if you've ever knocked your toe and hadn't been prepared to, like you just get up and boom, it's the worst feeling in the world. You kind of feel like... Not good at all. Very, very painful. I was getting up from the computer desk because I was making sure my video was uploading and I'm working on my uh, one from yesterday. And I got up and bam, hit my toe right there on the edge. And I did. I felt, I ripped off half of my toenail. Not cool. And I just felt like, oh, I've been shot. Oh my gosh, am I bleeding? <laughs> the kids probably think I'm like such a baby, but it hurt. Like, especially when you just not prepared. Like, sometimes you're like, oh yeah, I'm going to hit that. You know you're going to hit it. I don't know I going to hit that. So, I'm probably woke up Riley. I'm pretty sure I woke up, woke up Riley. Oh my gosh. Tongue tied. I'm pretty sure I woke him up though. Fixing him his milk and my coffee, getting the kids ready for breakfast. Brody's over there having fun with the cereal bag, obviously. <sighs> Anyways, but I wanted to hop on here and say good morning. Friday morning at that. Thank goodness it's Friday! Woo, yeah. These are not the drawers you've been seeking. <laughs> he comes down the hallway. Cue Star Wars tune. He says he's drawing mommy. I look, are you drawing you? I must say, we look pretty good. You think so? You're gonna draw dad now? Alright, draw dad. You gonna draw everybody? Hmm? All right. Well, I must say we look pretty good. Mm-hmm. Look at all that hair. <laughs> what's your mouth? Oh, that's my mouth. Oh, sorry. I thought that was my hair. <laughs> well, now we know. Mm-hmm. Good job. Looking good. Oh, I look in. Oh, Riley keeps bugging me. He keeps going, eyebrow, eyebrow. He bugs Brody with clowns. And for some reason, when he says eyebrow, it drives me insane. I don't know why, but it's just the way he says eyebrow and that he's obsessed with eyebrows. So it's kind of like, anyways, but I have just spent like the last hour looking for pictures. Okay. I was looking for one picture. Um, of my makeup yeah because I wanted to do the how I did my uh, makeup in high school tag because I I've had some very interesting um looks um I had this one look where I used to wear like this frosted blue up there and my whole eye like was smoked out and then I've had the look where I had like no eyebrows but like just black all around um, like my waterline and stuff, like black, black eyeliner. You couldn't even tell I had lashes. My eyebrows were barely there. My face was all just plain. I mean, I, I, I might as well have been dead. So, I've had some very interesting looks. But, uh, one that I remember. Oh. But one I remember, um, like, the best is this green look. Yeah. I used to wear like this green eyeshadow and I thought it was really cute to have like a lot of blush not only on my cheeks but my nose so anyway anyways I was looking through the pictures for that and then I came across this other picture but oh my gosh just looking at old pictures of how I used to wear things and I thought I was the stuff like you know very funny but anyways there was one I was like looking at and I was like where are my eyebrows like I know I had them. Where were they? And then Br Riley, Brody, kept saying, I bow, I bow. I'm going to get him to say it for you. What? I bow, I bow, I bow. It just creeps I me bow. out. 
Will you stop it with those eyebrows? Eyebrow. Oh. <laughs> it just creeps me out. <laughs> Why are you laughing like that? <laughs> uh, he's wearing his dad's shorts, <laughs> which could easily be a dress. Wee. A full outfit is dad's shorts. Wee. <laughs> what are you doing? I don't know what he's doing, y'all. He keeps making me rewind my um, witch's video to the part where I'm laughing like a crazy woman. He keeps going, play again, play again. <laughs> he likes that part, huh? Is that funny? Uh -huh. Alright, you laugh. No, no, no. No, sir. Uh -huh. Laugh like mommy does in the video. Uh -huh. That's not the way I laugh. Uh -huh. Say, ha, ha, ha. He's just acting like a baby now. <laughs> feel like I have been editing this video, my witch's video, for 12 hours, okay? My gosh, it's 1146 and I'm still over here working on it. Oh, <sighs> my computer's running slow or something, but I had to wait for everything to process. And then, like, me putting in pictures and stuff, it's just like 12 million things. I have, like, the slowest working computer ever. But, hey, it gets the job done. I mean, it may not be, like, the best quality of stuff, but... I mean, it does what I need it to do for now. I mean, I only use, I don't know if I've told you guys this before, but I use um, Windows uh, Live Movie Maker, which comes on the computer. And as far as, like, editing pictures, I like to use, uh, like, the picture, which is, like, pic collage or whatever. And then there, there's a couple other ones. I can't remember the names right off the bat. I'll put them up here because I can't remember because I'm on my phone recording. But... Anyways, I mean, I do all of my own editing, picture-taking, photography, whatever you want to call it, um, finding music, all of that stuff myself. So, I know some people are like, you know, this is not that great, but I don't have a bunch of high-tech, you know, equipment or a bunch of people, you know, just hanging around waiting for me to do something so they can work on, you know, my videos. So, I mean, like, hello, give me a thumbs up for that, not only with my vlogs, but when I do... Um, like these Halloween tutorial ones, I have to do all of the work, the makeup, the lighting, the filming, the editing, uh, the music, you know, photography, everything. So, yeah, give me a thumbs up for that. <laughs> but anyways, now that I've spent like 12 million hours here, I am hungry and I need some caffeine. So, I'm going after the soda pop, yeah. My Dr. Pepper. And for lunch, I'm just having some of this, what is it, like macaroni and beef. Yeah, it's in the microwave, by the way. I'm not eating it out of the can. Like, shh, please. I got more class than that. No, but uh, anyways. And then I just had like a mini, like, heart attack, okay? Because my father-in-law texted me and he was like, Did Dell tell you about losing his wallet on the beach and someone returning it with all the money still in it and stuff? And I was like... Um, no, he did not, because, like, as far as I was concerned, we didn't bring our wallet onto the beach. So I was like, um, no, he did not. And so I texted Dale, and I was, I was upset, and I was like, WTF, like, why, why didn't you tell me you lost your wallet on the beach? Like, I need to know this. Like, I thought I saw you the other day with your wallet, so I was, like, all upset and been out of shape and stuff. And he was like, yeah, I lost my wallet. And so I'm like, you know texting real fast I'm like what the hell Dale like don't you think you should tell your wife that and he was like babe that was like 18 years ago he's like who are you talking to I'm like dad because I call him dad anyways and he was like that was like 18 years ago and I was like oh <laughs> I felt up bad I was like my bad <laughs> But I guess 18 years ago, he had left, or he had lost his wallet somewhere on the beach, which, like, why would you take your wallet onto the beach? Anyways, and someone found it, and they returned it to him with all the money and everything still in there, and I was like, that was really nice. It's hard to find people that would do that nowadays. Nowadays, they, like, you know, take your money, take your money, take your cars, take your identity, <laughs> you know, but anyways, I was like, I've been out of shape, but, oh my gosh, my father-in-law, I swear, y'all, he lives in the past. Like, he will bring up stuff that happened, like in like the 60s and act like it was yesterday crazy but anyway i'm gonna eat my lunch try to finish this video and then i'm gonna go try to do this video <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't juice anyways trying to do this video 
um, of how I did my makeup in high school because that ought to be real fun and real yeah. interesting because I got to go to town later this evening. So Dale's going to have to walk around with me and my crazy looking makeup. Good times. Oh, goodness, goodness. Good times, y'all. Yeah, so I just finished filming how I wore my makeup in high school. Oh my gosh. So I thought I'd give you guys a little sneak peek before I try to fix it because I do have to go to town later and I don't want to uh, run around town looking like a crazy woman. Um, yeah, I don't know. Just think though, this is the face and the hairstyle and just style in general that Del fell in love with. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You'll ha you guys will have to watch the video. Oh my gosh, like insane. Can't believe I used to walk around like this, but... I did. So, yeah, I mean, look at these green eyes, y'all. Look at all that eyeliner. And it was like, the more I put on, the better. I was just like, mm-hmm, girl, you are getting it. You are looking good. I didn't wear lipstick. I would just line my lips and put on chapstick. Yeah, I know. Didn't contour. Didn't even bring my foundation all down here. Like, hmm, craziness. But I'm going to actually try to fix this a little bit. Um... So I can go to town and look kind of sort of decent. So maybe contour a little bit. Actually fix my brows. You know. I guess I'm just going to have to walk around looking really rosy today. <laughs> oh well. But. Yep. This is how I looked in high school. So. Yeah. Good times guys. Good times. Alright. So I toned it down just a little bit. I don't think my cheeks will quite be tamed. <laughs> but. Anyways, I tried to smoke out the green with a little bit of brown in there, though. But, anyways, I changed the shirt because I could not take another second of that, like, lime green just craziness. And it was so just snug. And back in the day, it was, like, the tighter the better. And now I'm just kind of like, you know, I need loose clothes. I look fat right there. Kind of bloated, y'all. Like, really bloated, obviously. But, anyways, these are the jeans. Um, this is what I got on here for. These are the jeans that I got yesterday um, from the thrift store. No, not yesterday. Day before yesterday? Yeah. Wednesday? Alright, then I got from the thrift store anyways the other day. I washed them and I was kind of iffy about drying them because I was really scared. But I am proud to say that they fit pretty good. And they look pretty good from the back side. Which is hard to see, but they look pretty good. And they're like called like wallflowers or whatever. Um, yeah, but they fit like just perfectly. I always find jeans that are either too short or too long. And I must say, these fit perfectly. So I can wear these with flip-flops or these little brown slip-on shoes that I really love to wear during um, the colder months when flip-flop season is out. Um, or I can wear them with my cowboy boots. So I'm pretty excited about that, but I just have that on with um, a t-shirt and just kind of put my hair down so I look a little bit more decent. I'll turn you guys around so you can see what I did to this. I don't know where it was found lying out of my drawer. So, what I did to my face to try to make it look a little bit better, <laughs> which is kind of hard, but I'm not going, you know, anywhere special in town. I mean, we're just going to run a couple errands. we got to go get Brody some new tennis shoes. So, um, I did, like I said, try to smoke out the green with a little bit of brown so it looks a little bit more natural. I did do my brows um, a little bit better than, I didn't spend a lot of time on them, but I did go ahead and try to touch them up a little bit, put on another coat, a mascara, and I tried to um, blend out the blush a little bit, didn't work, so I put a little bit of contour on, so maybe it would just kind of work with the blush. Uh, not really so much. I did get some of it off my nose, and I did try to blend it down on my neck, so it doesn't look that bad, but definitely a lot of blush like I do not know why I would wear a lot of blush like like I said other than I lived in Colorado and it was cold and in the mountains and I guess I just wanted that cute little like snow bunny look all around and maybe it did look good like I have some pictures where I was outside with the snow and it did it looked really cute it was like oh but here in the south where it's like hot not so much. It's just like, why is she so red? But I have seen some girls with a lot of blush and no blending. It's just like they were like, whoosh, whoosh. yeah, no blending, no nothing. Just use half a thing of blush on their face. No contour, no nothing. It's just like, yeah, but we just gonna make it work. Whatever. We just gonna go to town like this. I mean, like I say, we're not in a beauty contest. We just running some little errands. I've seen far worse. I don't look as bad as I thought, but yeah, we're just going to roll like this, but I thought I would show you guys my attempt to try to fix 
whatever I had going on here. The snow bunny look. That's what I'm going to call it, okay? The, it's like a leprechaun snow bunny mixed. But anyways, I'm going to go and tidy up a few things because the kids and Dale should be getting home from work soon. We're going to go to town. Uh, Brody needs some new tennis shoes. He told me yesterday, yeah, he said, Mom, my tennis shoes are talking to me. And I was like, what? And so he said it again, and I, my first instinct was, how much, can he, like, how much candy have you had, honey? Like, what are you talking about? He showed me, and his shoes had come on, like, glued and stuff. And I was like, okay, we need to get you some new tennis shoes. So we're going to go um, pick out some of those and then grab just a couple things, grab some dinner. And pretty much we'll be done for the evening. So, yeah. Dale tells me some stuff earlier. He's like, we're going to get something to eat. And then he tells me, he's like, you want to get some pizzas to put in the oven? No? Do I look like I want to go home and cook? No? I mean, sh I'm trying to sound all stuck up, but I mean, like, if you wanted me to cook something, you should have told me and I could have laid something out, I could have made arrangements, whatever. But no, I don't want to get pizza. We just had pizza Monday and the kids have been taking pizza, like, all this week for lunch. Yeah. I am not, I, I don't want pizza. I'm not into pizza tonight, so I don't know what I'm going to get, but they, they owe me no pizza. I kind of want something different though, but I don't know what. We just had tacos the other night. I really ain't in the mood for a burger. Gotta get something different though. Chicken tenders? Nah. That's what I'm getting. I don't know what I'm gonna get though, but there's these really cute like chicken houses in front of us. We're over here at um, Tractor Supply. They're so cute. I want to get one for my cats. No. See, look how cute those are, huh? Yeah, I would totally get that for my cats. I mean, not for no four hundred dollars, <laughs> but they look really nice. I mean, I know it's a chicken house, but I could totally like you know do it for my cats. They would love that, love it, love it, love it. And that was pretty nice too. But I really like this little barn one. I think that's cute. I got to fix them a little house for winter, so I'm definitely eyeballing some little pads for my cats. <laughs> Cat pad. Nice. Brody and I just went to go get him some new shoes. And they look like this one. Yeah, that's, that's what he got. Slap ones. They had tie ones. Mm -hmm. Do you like them? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he picked them out. He said these are the ones that are going to make him run the fastest. <laughs> I know I said that. <laughs> you did. You are running up and down the aisles. Mm -hmm. Anyways, but those are his new school Ouch. shoes. We're at Walmart, obviously. Come on, bud. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm going to my shoes. Uh, no. Okay, like Brody is finally getting around to spending his money, Miss Mary sent him for his birthday. He's over here checking out this mystery machine, which is pretty cool. And have these. Yep, those are pretty cool too. I must say, Ghostbuster stuff. <laughs> Yeah. It's not your birthday. <laughs> Tell us like, let's get out of this aisle. Your birthday is next. It's next, buddy. It's next. Oh, this little face. Batman. Oh, Pac-Man. I see. Okay, it's between that and let's pick one. I'm going to get... Just told Felicia bye. Now, we are back at Tractor Supply for welding wire. But, anyways, we ended up getting McDonald's for dinner. I don't know. I hadn't eaten at McDonald's in over a year and it all started because this little man right here. How's that Happy Meal treating you, boo? Good. Is it good? How's that Happy Meal treating me? You got Green Arrow? You got Green Arrow again. Whatever. We got like 12 of those Talking Toms. Those black ones. Yeah. Anyways. We have five. But uh, Dell, I think, got a Big Mac. He was sharing a story about a Big Mac when he was younger. I got chicken nuggets. They all got chicken nuggets. They got a Dr. Pepper, and the Dr. Pepper doesn't taste good, but hopefully the food will be alright. 
Yeah, ooh, put your feet down, gross. Your flip flops nasty. You nasty kid. Anyways, but after he gets his welding wire, then we're gonna go home. So, and the kids discovered that Zootopia is on Netflix. We've seen that um, at home, and we went to a uh, movie on the mountain and seen it. So, they're gonna watch it, I guess, again. I have no idea what I wanna watch. Unless y'all wanna watch The Boss. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. The Boss came in the mail today. Love Melissa. I love that big girl. She's so funny, but look at my cheeks. I still can't get over this blush. Wait till y'all see that video. Just, just, just wait. It's crazy. Yeah, that's why I was telling Dale. He's like, "What are you doing today, man? I've been editing all kinds of videos. I have recorded two videos. Like, I've been busy today doing other stuff around the house. I have been busy." He acts like I just been sitting home sleeping. I wish. Wish I could nap. I used to be able to nap. Not anymore. Not anymore. And sleep is like really starting to get less and less. I don't know what the deal is, but dear sleep, I love you. Please come back. Like seriously. My kid's almost four years old. I mean, I think we're safe to sleep through the evening. So like, please come back. I'm lo I love you. I don't know what I did to make you like hate me and run away, but I love you. Please come home. Okay.